Well, I don't really know what to say here. I was expecting better, although this is a obvious, um, you know, obviously the same as other scooters I've seen. I really didn't know they had this problem. Now, it did say do not use in the rain. But I used this in the rain once, and I mean, it wasn't raining that bad, like it wasn't unpleasant. Um, you know, it was coming down a little bit, but not enough to really bother me. Like, I wasn't even really particularly wet, but I suppose it was sitting outside the store for, oh, I don't know, maybe 15 minutes or so while I was doing stuff. No, it wasn't even sitting outside the store, I was carrying the thing, but it probably spent about 15, 20 minutes or so in the um, slight rain we had. And I haven't gone for any deep puddles or anything like that. I suspect the problem is water's coming through here. You see this wire going to the speed controller is uh, wet. The plugs on the speed controller are wet. The outside of the speed controller is wet. For those, uh, oh, this was just meant to be a teardown. I was not even expecting anything to be wrong with this. It still works, it still turns on, at least as far as I'm aware it does. Um, but if you look down here, we're full of water. That is water. That is your lithium ion battery. Now, you know, lithium ion batteries don't like water. Um, there's a battery management board in, in there which controls the functions of the scooter, or the battery rather, that balances the cells. If that gets compromised, there's a good chance the battery could overheat and explode. Um, so this is pretty bad. This is a pretty bad engineering problem for this scooter. I think, to be honest, I know it says don't use in the rain, but this, in my opinion, is unacceptable. I am renovating. So there's your water coming out the head tube. There's no tiles or anything on the floor. No carpet, rather. It's, um, I'm putting the uh, carpet up and putting carpet tiles down. That's a whole other video, that one. But all this chassis here seems to be sealed. They've sealed the bottom so the water can't actually get out. Um, but it's coming through the handlebar assembly, through the folding mechanism, and down through here. Now, what is the solution to this? Well, it's actually pretty simple. Um, you see this bit here where there's this bit of tube? You know, put the wires through here, or run the, wire, run the wires externally. I want to say run the wires externally through here, so there's less chance of water getting in here because the water's actually got a head, it's got some pressure behind it if it fills up the whole head tube with water. Um, so run the cables externally and weld up this thing, that's what they should have done, that's what they, sh they should do from the factory. I don't know if the Exime or whatever the other scooter that looks the same as this is has this problem, maybe it does, maybe people only use these on dry days. But I live in the countryside, I live in England, um, so this is a little bit unacceptable um, in my opinion. Now. Would I still say buy this scooter or not? I'm not going to say it's an absolute deal killer, but it's certainly something you want to be aware of. Do not use this thing in the rain at all. Because um, essentially this thing is destroyed as we uh, talk about it here. I mean, yeah, I think I'm going to return this. I can. There's no warranty for wood sticker on the bottom, by the way, just in case anyone is wondering. Um, but yeah, that concludes this video of the little electric scooter. That, well, no, it doesn't. Here's the battery. It's a Sanyo battery. It's pretty big. It takes up the whole space. And it obviously has a hub motor in the front. But yeah, this is only meant to be a teardown. You can see our one, how many FETs we've got. One, two, three, four, five, six. It's a six FET controller, which is pretty standard. It does look like you can put a bigger electric bike controller inside here. Um, this is all, you know, this looks like I could put a thousand watt controller in here and a couple of uh, 6S LiPos. <laughs> Maybe we're not returning it. Maybe we're going to do that. I'll see. That concludes this video. See you later.